I'm here once again on the campus of Fairleigh Dickinson University in Florham Park, New Jersey. And today, you guys will get a chance to check out the upcoming season for the 2018-2019 Fairleigh Dickinson Devils men's basketball team. I'm here with Jeff Slanovic, the new head men's basketball coach at Fairleigh Dickinson University. Coach, thank you so much for coming out today. I appreciate thank you. it. Thank you. Absolutely. Absolutely. Thanks for having me. Of course. So my first question to you, Coach, this year, getting re you're almost on the verge of starting your first season here. Tell me how things have been so far as the new head men's basketball coach. Yeah, absolutely. It's been really exciting. Um, our guys have really bought in. We had a couple good days of tryouts, a um, lot of interest in playing for us, and uh, I'm really happy with how much we have in thus far. I've been really impressed with their recall from day to day, um, but we're to the point now where we just want to start playing somebody else. You can only play against yourself so many times, um, and uh, we're excited for next Thursday against CSE. As are we, and my next question to you, Coach, is going into your first season, what are some of the expectations and goals that you have for yourself as well as the team in general? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, obviously you want to win. Everybody wants to win. Um, I think things come together a little bit when, when you win, but we really want to lay the foundation um, for the culture moving forward, um, the commitment to getting better every day, um, regardless of, of whether that's small victories or big victories. Um, for a lot of these guys, they don't know what it's like to, to have a winning season at the college level, and they, a lot of them don't know what it takes to, to have a 500 or above season, and, and trying to get them to understand just what you have to do on day in and day out. Um, you got to bring it to every drill, to every practice, to every conditioning um, exercise, all that kind of stuff. Um, so really just trying to get them to, to win each practice, win each drill. Uh, and I think in time that will allow us to win on the court in big games. Win each practice is a really good quote that I like there, Coach. And my next, my next question kind of leads into this. Obviously last year didn't go the way I'm sure a lot of people hope, yeah. but what are going to be some of the keys to have a turnaround going into this season? Yeah, for sure. Um, there's no doubt we're not going to be one of the bigger teams um, in the league. So we've, we've got to do what we're taught. Um, we've got to box out. We've got to commit to them getting one shot. Um, we've got to defend the way that we want to defend. And then once we get stops and we limit them to one shot and get the rebound, we got to go and we got to take care of the ball. Um, when I look at the stats from, from the previous years, we got to shoot the ball better and we got to hold them to a better shooting percentage. Um, and those two things go hand in hand, I think. So for us, uh, initially, the two most important things in, in our mind and our staff's mind are definitely we've got to limit turnovers and, and limit their extra possessions on the offensive glass. Getting better and better is certainly an important thing. And my last question to you, Coach, is this. If you have one message you want to send to the players and everybody watching here, what is the message you want to send to get ready for the 2018-19 season? Yeah, I think we've got a, a really balanced group. We've got some veterans who have played in, in a lot of games, um, and we have some young guys who have played in a lot of games um, as freshmen and sophomores. So you add to that a, a group of five or six transfers and um, a new coaching staff, a new way of playing, um, hopefully some new energy, and, and obviously an exciting brand of basketball. So we'd love to have a lot of people out. Um, we were fortunate, if you check our schedule out online, a lot of our early games are at home. We're right here on Madison Ave. We're right at CSE. Um, but most of November is spent right here. So um, it's not conference play, um, but we do open up with, with two of the top teams in the league at home in conference play. So um, the sooner that you guys can get out, hopefully you'll, you'll enjoy the brand of basketball that the Devils are going to play. So they're going to be exciting brand of basketball. Well, Coach, I really appreciate you taking Absolutely. the time to come on today, and I wish you nothing but the best this upcoming season. Thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. I'm here with forward Darren Davey. Darren, thank you for coming out today. I appreciate it. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Nice to meet you as well. So my first question, Darren, is, you know, you guys are very close to beginning the 2018-19 season. Just talk to me about how practice and training camp has gone so far. Um, you know, so far, practice and training camp has been going well. Uh, coach Slanovic, uh, he's took over the range from our former coach, and he's really been implementing a lot of his uh, ide uh, ideologies and techniques and philosophies, and we really enjoy it. Every it's been a lot of fun, you know. Certainly seems like you guys are having a lot of fun out there. Yeah. Kind of brings me to the next question. You obviously now have a new head coach. Is, is, it, is it a challenge to obviously you know, learn a new system or just learn a different head coach, or is it just kind of like the same? Um, I think I can speak for all, all of us. You know, It is going to be a challenge at first, but the more and more we go at it, the better we'll get it. So I'm sure we'll be fine in the end. I'm sure you will be. So my next question, Darren, is this. For you personally, what are some of the goals that you want to try to achieve this year as well as the team goals? Mm -hmm. Well, you know, me, of course, me being, you know, the cocky person that I am, just playing, just playing. I want us to win. I want us to win, you know, but as to, uh, we have to take it like one step at a time. You know, Rome was a building a day, so we all know that. So each practice, we just got to go hard and listen to what coach is saying, and we'll be all right. I really like you used that. Rome was a building a day. I like, you know, just that whole process and everything. That's great. Well, Darren, really, I really appreciate you coming on today, and I wish you nothing but the best this upcoming season. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
I'm here with Ford Rajan Dixon. Rajan, thank you so much for coming out today. I appreciate nice it. Nice to meet you. Thank you. So my first question to you, Rajan, is this. Just looking at this you know, training camp so far and everything, how, how do you feel for you personally you're doing and how the team is looking so far? I feel as though we are doing good as a team. Uh, practice has been fun, competitive, and like, I mean, it's a learning experience now. We got a new coach. It's a new system. It's just something that we get, we have to get used to. That's a very good point. And I like that you use the word fun because I think if, if you're not having fun, you know, there, there really isn't any point. Yeah. You kind of lead me to my next question mentioning that, you know, just do you feel that, you know, having fun is one of the more important things when it comes to just, you know, playing the, playing the sport of basketball, just being a team in general? Yes, I mean, that probably is the most important thing is just like having fun. Like, that's what make the, that's what make it like the sport it is. Like basketball, you know, it's fun. It's competing every day, going against each other, and then you get it. Like you get a chance to use it against someone else. So that's how we use it. Shows you against your opponents. I like that. So my next question, Rajan, is this: Looking, getting ready for the 2018-19 season. What are some of the goals that you have for yourself personally? What are some of the goals that the team has going into this year? Uh, win. Like that's probably the most important goal that we have. But like. It just takes step at a time, step by step. And like right now, we're just trying to win a conference. That's the like the short term goal. Mm -hmm. And it's going to lead it to long, long term goals, like probably win a national tournament or get deep into like the national tournament, stuff like that. That's great. And my last question to you, Rajan, is this if you have one message you want to send you know, all the fans, everyone watching here, what do you want to tell the fans to get ready for the 2018 19 season? Don't sleep on us. Don't sleep on us. It's going to be a good season. Y'all going, going to like it. It's going to be a good season. Don't sleep on it. Do not sleep on FDU. Well, Rashad, I really appreciate you coming out today and good luck this season. Thank you. I appreciate you. From the campus of Fairleigh Dickinson University in Florham Park, New Jersey, I'm Neil Velpiano.